dun, 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 dun. Hey, uh, this is a final video of uh, the Zombicide uh, first edition miniatures. Uh, you're looking at the first eight of the female walkers here that I finished. Um, finished them a few weeks back, just never had a chance to get a video out on them. But what I want to let you guys know, especially if you're a, be a beginning war gamer like me or a miniature painter, doesn't take much to get the miniatures painted and get them on the board or the game table. As you can see, I'm not that great of a miniature painter. I just pretty much did some basic colors on them and uh, threw some blood on them and all that and gave them a wash and then a matte spray to protect the paint because these these minis are going to be handled pretty dang, going to be handled a lot. So um, this is the first set and um, let's check out the second set here. Okay, and here's the second set of the female walkers. A little bit more risque, as you can tell. But um, they were very fun to paint. And um, again, did the same thing as I did with the other set of female walkers. Uh, Try to make them as different as possible. Skin tone, uh, colors of the uh, dresses wearing and all that. So a uh, real brief uh, slideshow following. Uh, after all this, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and throw a picture of all the minute all the zombicide uh, minis uh, painted uh, it, it does make a big difference having uh, all the all the miniatures painted and on the on the game board and all that so there is There is a big difference. So um, Don't really have to use those color markers too for the bases like for the survivors um, Once when you paint them up, you know exactly what they look like and who they are and all that so I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with the, the gray minis. Um, it's just my preference. I like to have the color on them. And um, anyways, uh, I'm going to be starting uh, mission number four here pretty soon. And man, that last uh, last mission was almost an hour long, and I try to break that down as much as I can. Um, had that at an hour and 20 minutes or 30 minutes or something like that, and try to edit as much as I can out of it. I get caught up in the in the joy and the fun of playing though it's just great um ned's dead man famous pulp fictions uh quote there so and that's kind of what happened in that previous game so if you guys have a chance uh with these uh playthrough videos you know you can set them in the background as background noise as you're painting miniatures or building kits or and all that stuff so it doesn't you know and then um you'll hear you'll know when something big happened because i'll scream out loud or whatever so just having a blast um alrighty i'll stop rambling here uh here comes a slideshow of the miniatures and uh comment below subscribe hit the bell um and that's all that so i hope you guys have a good day and take care